Hey mate, I'm Deal here. How are you going? And welcome to Kerbal Space Program. Love this game. So excited for number two. I cannot wait. But also another thing I quickly have your attention before we get started. As you probably remember in my other video, if you have seen Little Big uh, Factory, I've been doing a Cedar Foundation charity. Well, I'm not personally doing it. Uh, Pet Bond's running it. I have the information down below if you want to check it out. There's also a donation link down below too. Uh, it's pretty much about raising... Uh, Seeing eye dogs for people, there's 1,500 people on a waiting list just to get help for, like, to get a dog that they need, that they can just do a normal life with. So, like, it's very important. I feel very passionate about it because it involves helping my community, helping people out there. And it also involves helping animals out and all that, so I'm all about this. Um, I've downloaded my, download, I've donated myself, so, like... Just asking, you can do a three, five, ten dollar donations. I'm not sure about the online one. I think you can actually put out a specific amount you want online, but I install at the moment until they get a code that they can do just that amount. But anyway, thank you for your time just to hear me out. So uh, I'll be advertising this while it's running. Uh, also, like Windows, Windows Prime Seven. I've just woken up, so I'm an absolute mess. Uh, Prime Seven or Channel Seven, one of those ones. Uh, they're also doing Puppy Olympic Games. Pretty much, it's Olympic Games, but for puppies to help advertise and spread awareness. Anyway, thank you so much for your time. Let's get straight into these missions. Play mission. Oh, this is new. Dawn of the Space Age. This is all a new mission screen. Okay, for each mission, you can see the mission briefing. Okay. Um. Greetings, this mission test your mental is dawn off a space age. You build a basic rock to, to a reach a low altitude second. You build a high altitude um, sounding rocket that will te temperature reading from the upper atmosphere. Finally, you create a carbon first artificial satellite generally and create an orbiting of kernel. The mission is about how you'll perform under pressure or lack thereof. You made it into orbit of uh, Vascold 2 on one of our first crewed mission, but something about to go terribly wrong. <laughs> let's start this let's start the one that's a valve being in trouble because who wouldn't want to see that this mission is all about well you perform a pressure you made it in orbit okay you, our computers report a massive cascading electric failure our craft stay calm there's nothing to worry about but on completely unrelated note we'll, when you run a crew report so we can run your crew report okay oh I thought that was actually Ah, uh, crew report. How do I, uh, b -b 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 crew report. Crew report while in space. Nick. Seems very much in space right now. The sky seems mostly beyond. <laughs> I fucking love that. Transmit data. Unable to. A vessel cannot. Ah, uh, we promise that isn't one of our cuts. Kermit Drake, you need to give us a crew report stat. Overwrite report. Keep experiment. Ah, okay. Good news is your vitals are okay for now. That's bad. Is new. The bad news is well, everything's else. But don't worry. Our engineers have a plan to sort off. There's a communication satellite nearby that designed to stay in orbit for a long time, so it has its own maintenance terminal. If you're bored, that complete reset the vessel computer, which should fix the problem. You need to either turn it over once you're close enough, ready to get the satellite before the ship starts. Sign effect. You need to hurry. Oh. What? Why? Uh, why can I not? I. Oh, this is gone. Uh, yep. Um. What? What if we just speed this? <laughs> you didn't make it home. All right. Uh, close. Uh, let's just revert the fly. Yeah. Let's let's just. Oh, okay. Um, that, why are you showing me that view? Where's my mouse? Okay, thank you. Crew report. Keep data. Okay. The crusader sound to affect your craft electric. You need to hurry. But. But how do I, how do I, how do I get over there? But I don't understand. Jebediah, Tonfold, what do we do? <laughs> Their faces. Tonfold, what, what do? What do? I don't know what to do. All right. I guess this is life now. Just gonna just blow up. Yep. Okay. 
Oh yeah. Never mind. Let's just quit that one. <laughs> how, how about we just start a new one? We'll, we'll just start an actual game. Um. So I got a little big deal for the factory. You gotta go. Deal. Deal. Big little. Little. I said. Little. Fuck yeah. Alright. Well, let's not worry about that one. Options. Let's just go easy because I can't remember how to play this goddamn game. And because I'm a giant bubbling baby. Let's just. Yeah, let's just do the easy. Ugh, excuse me. Okay. Um. Uh, where's the vehicle assembly line? There it is. Vehicle! Alright. What? What do I have? Parachutes, okay. In that case, we're gonna make the ultimate <laughs> rocket. Oh god, this is gonna go horrible, isn't it? We're gonna call it the Yes Man. Say that bad boy, let's launch it! Oof. Are we excited? We're gonna hit new heights! Oh, oh, we gotta crash instead. No, we're good. Okay, so we're gonna press R for that. That's toggle R S S S A S. These I just know you need because they stabilize the ship as it rockets off. Three, two, one, go, Jebediah! What's that from your view? Oh, that's all right. Oh my God! <laughs> yeah, maniac, maniac, oh, the Oh, how high are we gonna reach? Where's our peak height? So we're on 4,300, about 44,000, 45,000, 46,000. Actually, it's 4,600. Uh, okay, so 4,600 is our peak height at the moment. Let's just. Yeah, it's fine. We don't need to worry about the stability. It'll live. A maniac, maniac on the floor. Pull the chute. Oh yeah, Jebediah, you did me proud, Jebediah. I love you. Ah, uh, fucking this game is just—it's just fun. It's just harmless. Oh, we were off a little, little bit. Jebediah, I uh, can't evacuate. Oh, I want, I want. Okay, let's recover said vessel. I'm not playing the missions just because I have no idea what I am doing. So I might muck around with a little bit. And um, go from there. Uh, where's my research facility de department? That one. Okay, let's go there. How many do I have that? Um, uh, yeah, we we'll go that. I only have ten points left. All right. So that last assemble the. So we had the yes man. Okay, go here. We're gonna go incredibly, incredible heights. Guarantees. Truth. Guarantee. I can let you smother me. Nirvana is my jam. Well, one of those, because I'm pretty sure, yeah, that separates them. No, we want you down there. Okay. Now we're making some progress. Do we have any ones that. Okay, so we have none that actually pops off. Oh yeah, nice cock. Okay, cool. I want that on a separate one because then I'm gonna use those thrusters, those uh, boosters, as a way to start it up, and then once they run out, then use the other rocket if it has enough energy. What we're we gonna call this? The little big man. Because <laughs> I'm so creative. I don't know if that's gonna be enough parachutes, but. I don't know why I put a parachute on those ones because it's not like it's going to, you know, make a difference. So it goes that one to that one to that one to that. Okay, let's that, that that's good. That's good sign. Ah, it's too heavy. Fuck. How about we just make that that one? No. Fuck. 
The order. Fuck. God damn it. But I'm very excited for the next one because apparently the whole next one it's all about colony, like colonizing. And there's even meant to be a multiplayer in it. How insane is that? Okay, so this one's a this one shall take us to the moon. Ah, their platforms say words English. Okay, Jebediah, are you ready, sir? To the moon! Oh yeah, look at that speed! Oh yeah, we're just going straight up. Jebediah. Interior overlay. I want to see it from your view. What does all this mean, Jebediah? See, I hope in the next one that they actually make it that it's fully. Pretty sure it's fully. If you know what you're doing, that you can. Okay, next one. You know what? I'm gonna make a challenge for myself. One, I actually start playing it a bit more. Is to do first person only. I should have put other equipment on it. Island airfield. What I mean. What I mean is. Oh wait. There's other launching sites. That's dope as fuck. What I mean is I should have put that mystery goo and all that on there to do the analyzations. Yeet! Okay, let's do a crew report. Keep the data because that gives us good research. He's a maniac, maniac on the floor. Yeah! We don't care about your... Oh, it's not stable enough to do this. Oh my god, we've, we've, we've hit heights. That would never hit before. Does that mean that it's boost? Oh, yeah. Oh, are we? For a second, I thought, oh, we actually might. The way the uh, Kerbal, Kerban, planet moved. Oh, I was hoping that we actually might have, you know, hit the bloody, um, where we land, like, started off rocketeering from. Oh, actually, no, we speed that bad boy up. <laughs> Look at him! <laughs> I love when shit goes wrong and they're like, ah and they just start clapping like, I had it one time. Where things are going wrong and he's just like, and he's just sitting there clapping or happy like, like. <laughs> you know, disembark while off Kerbal surface, let's try to complete, okay. Does, wait, does that mean when I land I get to see my beautiful boy? Probably not. Oh, we are. We are rocket people. We are big brains right now. That's what we are. And thump. Recover vessel. The vessel. All right. Ah. Yes, collect all the science. Science bitches. Um. That one would be actually. Actually, I'm pretty sure I have enough to buy both. Yeah, I do. Okay, now there's a way. Ah, that's right. Yeah, you right click on it and that's how you can increase it so you can have heavier rockets. Right, right, right. The little big man. So we shall create said little big man again, but it's going to be the Mark II of the little big man. That one. That one. That one. We're just gonna ease into this. I've spent too many times playing this game, like really rushing into crap that, you know, and not actually understanding what's happening. So that's why. Oh, actually, yes, that because that means if I put these on, I should be able to get rid of them, and might not burn up as much fuel because I'm pretty sure it has to do with weight and all that. Why would I have that there? Okay, that one up there. Why aren't you working with me? Okay, so we got that. Um, what else? Make you like a little shark. She's a maniac, maniac gone from. What's this? Uh, for local atmosphere pressure. Okay, so what we what we're going to do is ah, uh, see. All right, I guess I'm not. Ah, mouse, hold mouse wheel into zoom. All right. Okay, I gotcha. So we want one of those. 
one of these, because then when we log on, when we actually get to space, we'll be able to get more science for it, which means we can upgrade a lot, a lot better. Yeah, that should be fine. We're going to call this little man Mark number two. Nope, that's that. All right, let's launch. He's a moody, moody on the floor. <laughs> All right. So we go to that one and disengage to go to that one. All right. Power! Oh, yeah. Jebediah, are you excited? Are you excited to go to lengths that you have never seen? Because I am. I'm, I'm pretty well excited for this. There's Mun. The furthest I've ever... Oh, I forgot Minus was actually a thing too. I've landed on Minus once. And Duna, that's it, that's Mars. Like, it was a pain in the ass and a fluke. So, like, I'm hoping with the next Kerbal Space Program being about setting up on other worlds and that, that they might make it a bit easier for me, but, like, for people, because this game confused the absolute shit out of me the way crap work. Like, I could not comprehend. It's fine. Oh, we're actually breaking the heat while we're, you know, leaving that atmosphere. We're, we're going. Oh, let's make a turn you off. Because then, yes, I know. Because if I get up to about here and I start angling it, we might be able to put someone in orbit. And that might be a nice little way, you know, to make some sort of progress on this. Because, like, as I said, it's going to take me a bit, actually, because it's such a difficult game because it uses, like, such mechanics and physics and all that. My wee little pre brain cannot comprehend it. No, that's not the one I'm after, is it? It is. I'll let change the um, symbol. Alright. I'm probably not out far enough. Alright. Now is a good time to... Yeah, I'm not... Nah, I wasn't out far enough. Fuck! Alright, let's just... Rocket it. Rocket man! Oh, yeah, why am I out here, eh? I wanted to do some tests. Observe mystery goo. Goo seems to have clumped into a sphere. It's almost like it's come brittle. Good to know. Log temperature. Mm, yes. Log pressure. And then crew report, which probably not going to... Oh, it's still actually got some science. Okay, so we've got a lot of science rolling on this. Yeah, that was the one I was meant to follow. God damn it. Ah! God damn it. Yeah, I get it. There's no recovering from that. Okay, alright. Can already deploy. Why did it not deploy before and then just. Okay, what? Oh my god. Jamada! <laughs> oh god. That's probably the physics that they're talking about. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> oh no, are we gonna blow up because we're gonna land in the ocean? Please tell me that's not a thing. And gently down. Pretty sure that's... Yeah, that's where our little airplane... Oh, thank God for that. I heard a... And got actually really scared. How much science did we earn from that one? Hmm. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Sorry, I've, I'm just a weak... Oh, 75 science. Nice. And no XP game. Why didn't you get no XP? We went on a rocket. We did. That's... Okay, so I want that for lighting. Yeah, I want a better fuel tank. I don't have enough science. All right. Anyway, I think that's where I'm going to leave this one here. We're going to call it quick. So, uh, let me know in the comments below if you enjoyed it or just hit the like button just to let me know. Maybe it's that ask for likes and that is just legit because 
I got a few and likes on my videos and what they come up with, so like, for example, like Yandere came up more than my code name Cure, so then I'm gonna go with Yandere because that's what you guys after, that's what you want. So that's why I asked for like and I'm liking that because it tells me what you guys are enjoying and then it, you know, I can actually bring out stuff catered to you. Um, and also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button to uh, get notified when I upload on my channel. I really appreciate the support you're giving me now. Also, don't forget to check out the charity down below if you might be interested in all that. I'll thank you if you do. And I guess I'll see you in the next video. Kakya. Yeah, yeah.